Hey, hey, spring lefay, simply tarot. Okay, first off, we got Aquarius. Special message. If you have Aquarius in your birth chart, this may be for you. These readings are timeless. Um, the feeling today has been uh, really big about, or what I'm feeling now before doing this, is big about trust. And um, how people, you know, play games with other people's emotions and um, aren't honest, you know, with what they put out there. And it's just, it's a heavy feeling. So, I'm not sure, you know, who all is going through that. But, yeah, it's like, um, it feels like whew, very heavy. Very, very, very heavy. You, you know, you would think if people were honest about their feelings, other people would be honest too. But some people just can't do that. That's, it. <laughs> That's life, yeah. But let's see what we got for you today. Um, this may or may not have anything to do with that. You just, I don't know. That's a heavy feeling that's coming to me. So, we will see. Okay. Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. It wanted to jump, but it didn't. The sun card wanted to come out. Okay. Aquarius, Aquarius. Okay, balance them emotions. You know, people do us wrong. But, <laughs> I'm getting karma with that card. Yes, somebody's having trouble balancing their emotions. And, you know, when people do you wrong, you know, if they done you wrong, then there is karma. So, you know, that's something to look at. And, you know, it's no one, you know, I mean, it's not good to look at, you know, and think, well, oh, they're going to get theirs. It's not like that. I don't look at it that way. Um of course, I'm just nice, but <laughs> I might be too nice sometimes. Um, but yeah, it's like, it feels like you're, you are, honestly, you're learning lessons about, you know, it's like you're going through something today, whoever, whomever, and I feel like this is for many, that has to do with emotions, and it has to do with, you know, past and and those those relationships where you felt like you were wronged and you know trying to balance balance it and it also feels like you know that for many of you you have learned um, a, a lot of lessons but one lesson you are learning or have learned it feels like is about you know your emotions and how people will just They'll just take your emotions and just stomp on them. Basically, I mean, some people, you know, will not. They just won't treat your emotions. You know, it's like, I, I don't know why people are like that, but some are like that. What else do we need? For Aquarius, please. For Aquarius, please. For Aquarius. Special message. Yeah, you need to leave the past behind, but see, you're looking back. You're looking back. That's why it's reversed. You're looking back. Leave it in the, leave it in the past because, you know, <sighs> this is what you have to look forward to. You know, this is our wish card. And you have, you know, it feels like... Leaving that in the past is going to make you a whole lot happier. You know, if they, they're just who they are, people like that. And, you know, we have to try to, our best to move forward whenever this happens to us. And um, regain our happiness. Yeah. 
That thing was reversed in this deck and then it flipped over. Huh. Well, I didn't even know it was reversed. Huh. Okay. Now I'm going to have to. Okay. Can you clarify the page of cups, please? Can you clarify the page of cups? Clarify the page of cups, please. Clarify the page of cups. Hmm. Someone from your past has feelings for you, it looks like. They've got a cup for you. Emotion. Can you put... Okay, this person's watching you. You're like that dot. This is someone from a distance. And it's like they're making a decision about coming back together with you. Can you tell me more? Can you tell me more? Okay. Oh my goodness, you got two people. You've got two people. Now one of these may be someone that you were recently dealing with, it feels like. Or someone that, if you've been thinking about one certain person today that had done you, you feel like they stomped on your emotions, this is them. This feels like this person taking on the King of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like that goes right here with this. Can you tell me more about the Emperor? That's what I was going to say. Yeah, you don't trust this person anymore. You don't trust them. Can you tell me more about the King of Pentacles? Can you tell me more about the King of Pentacles? This is someone who might seem, um, you know, well, you could be dealing with Aries, but this is someone, or it could be someone that, you know, is in authority or has an authority fit, you know, they're an authority figure or maybe they're a boss or um, this is someone I'm feeling has a very stern nature. They're kind of stuck in their ways and um, maybe bossy a bit, feels like. Can you tell me, can you clarify the King of Pentacles? Okay, a broken heart. Hmm. Okay, this person has a broken heart over you, and they're all in their head over. They broke your heart. Some of you, they broke your heart. Some of you, both people may have got their heart broke. You and them. This person, they think about you constantly. They are in their head about you. Thinking about you. And, and thinking about you. Praying. Asking for guidance. They may be asking. Um, I feel like it, for some of them they're praying. But for others they may be asking people they trust for guidance about you. This is someone at a distance from you it feels like. Flopped. Long to come. Okay. Somebody's coming towards you. I feel like this person's coming towards you now. For some of you, this person could try to come towards you too. I'm being told to put it right here. Can you tell me more? Yeah. Your worth and your values being seen. You're standing on your own. Can you tell me more? Can you tell me more? Can you clarify? I was saying clarify the Nine of Pentacles. See, you're standing your ground. You're knowing your worth and your value, and you're no longer taking any crap. Yeah, that's where you got to get back to, and it feels like somebody's fell backwards a little bit today, or recently, or whenever you see this. You know, as far as the emotions, but it feels like you, you are having a growth experience from this, and what that's doing is it feels like it's it's moving you towards your wish, towards having happiness, a new beginning. 
Can you tell us more? Can you tell us more? So if you're having a bad day all because of, you know, what somebody did to hurt you, it feels like you've got somebody else over here that is watching you and... So you've been manifesting this. So you've been manifesting... You've been manifesting someone coming in. You, you've been manifesting truth. And you've been standing in your truth. And you've been working on yourself. Okay, you've had a day. Or you've had a period in time where, you know, emotions got the best of you. But it's moving you forward. You're standing your truth. And you've been manifesting, wanting something real. Wanting someone truthful. You know, you've been work, putting in the work and you want someone who will work with you. It's not against you. Yeah, you want something real. You want a, a real relationship. A truthful, honest relationship where someone will work with you. Well, you've got somebody watching you from a distance, it feels like. You possibly have two people. Possibly this person over here, too. But you you don't trust them. There's, they've done something, and it feels like you can't trust them. And it's got to do with your emotions and playing games. Or it feels like you they played games with you. Okay, you're following your intuition. Keep following in it. Keep following your intuition. Hold your, yourself up high. Don't let yourself drop to a level where you're going to have to climb back up. And also, you know, I feel like you're being seen. You may not feel like it, but you are. You're being seen. You got justice here. Things are, things are, it may not seem like they're, they're moving forward or looking up, but they are. They are. Do we need any more? Do we need any more? Do we need any more? Yeah, see, you've been left. You've been abandoned. You've been left behind. You've been hurt, but you're moving away from it. Look, I knew it was on the bottom. You're moving away from it, and this is where you're at. You are the empress. You know, and, and it, it feels like, you know, you're going to have... This, somebody's a soulmate. Somebody is a soulmate, and then someone has the devil card attached to them. But you're going to have a victory. Now, one of the, it's a choice between two. Look. See, someone's looking. It's like you, you know, you may be having a day of looking back at the past, but I feel like you're going to pull yourself out of that. Um, it feels like that, honestly, it feels like this person over here is looking at the past. You know, it, it does. It feels like they're looking at the past. This person may be too. You know, it's like there was a... You've been sowing your seeds. You've been waiting on them to come in. You've been manifesting, you know, and you're watching for the ships to come in. And it's like when the blink of an eye, whenever you're not expecting it, that's when something happens. Yeah, happy. You know, the wheel starts moving in your favor. See? Offer of love. So, wherever, whatever spot, you know, get out of it. Pull yourself back up. You know, I have them days. Oh, I have them days myself, you know, where, um, yeah. <laughs> you know, people should not play games with other people's emotions. That's just all they are to it. And, um. You see, even when I don't have the days where I feel other people's emotions, oh my goodness, you know, and I have to watch because that can get me to thinking about my own self. Okay, what does Aquarius, oh, it wanted to come out. 
What does Aquarius need to know? He, Aquarius. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. What does Aquarius need to know? What does Aquarius need to know? Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. For Aquarius, please. For Aquarius. Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. For Aquarius, please. This could be the one you've already met. The romantic partner you see. Well, this is it's really beautiful. Um, just, you know, like I said, just pull yourself back out of it. You know, yeah. And have an awesome, awesome day. Bye.